Hey everyone, it's Ryan and you are watching LGBTV. I'm here with some special guests, Alexis and Dolly. And you've seen Alexis in some of my other videos, so I'm going to give Dolly a little chance to introduce himself. So I'm Dolly. I'm a college student right now. I'm friends with Ryan and Alexis because they're super awesome and I love them a lot. And I'm queer. We are going to talk about the division within the queer community. This is something I've experienced firsthand. It's definitely really displeasing to see so many people hating against you in your own community and it's not welcoming at all and that's not good because there's people that really need to feel welcomed because all they really have is their own community. Dolly, what's your experience? Like, when outside people see, I guess, gay people, they're like, oh my god, gay people are so cool, you know, like, they must love each other. But really, like, every community has its divide, and the gay community definitely has its divide. Especially if you don't have a certain look, like, I'm not the, you know, fit gay guy that most people think of. I'm not saying everyone does, but most people think of that. I've had a lot of people bully me about it. How does the bullying from your own community make you feel? It feels really crappy because it's like if you can't trust someone in your own community to make you feel, you know, welcome, how are you going to expect to, you know, feel any, any love from anyone else, from any other community? Yeah. Alexis, what do you think? For me, I haven't yet to experience hate from within the community because I'm not a stereotypical queer person, you know, I don't look any certain way and I have never experienced it publicly. I have online because online, you know, I state that I'm queer so that, you know, people know that. A lot of times people will assume that I'm pansexual, especially for dating Ryan. I've seen a lot of hate within the community, but I have really never experienced it firsthand because I don't come off as one way or the other. When you see other trans people hating on trans people, how does that make you feel? It makes me feel really frustrated and upset because, like Dolly said, why would it, you know, when you're supposed to be a community and, you know, you have so much in common with one another, why do you get so upset with each other? Mm -hmm. If you're watching this and you are, you are queer and you're part of a, you know, you're a trans or lesbian or bisexual or pansexual or whatever, like there's, just know that you're not the only person that is how you identify and just because someone doesn't match you know someone doesn't match what you are that doesn't mean that they're not what they identify as whatever they feel comfortable yeah. with that's what they are and you just have to respect it yeah there's there's no such thing as being not gay enough or being not trans enough everyone is what they are you don't have to fit a certain stereotype to be something you could just be yourself and <laughs> I think the most like important thing that people should really realize is like when you're hating on members of your own community while you're also fighting for equality for your com for your community that makes it really hard because it's like why would someone want to accept a community that can't even accept themselves so it's important to stand together um, one of my favorite bands Smoke or Fire punk band one of their songs there's a line that says, divided we stand, united we fall. And I think that's really powerful because I feel like a lot of uh, minority communities are standing divided, really. So they're not standing at all. And that makes everyone fall. We say that we're fighting for equality for all when we're just tearing down the equality within our own community that we've already built. Yeah, it doesn't make sense. I know sometimes you might bully people or we might bully people because we're not secure with ourselves. Mm -hmm. um, if you feel that you're not fitting a certain thing that you want to fit into, go and look for someone, go look for help, talk to someone about it. Don't take it out on other people. It's really unhealthy. Yeah. <laughs> it, I mean, and when you like bully someone, you're not going to feel good about yourself, you know? You're going to feel like shit. Yeah. <laughs> I think we've all been bullied, right? For being queer and we know what it feels like. I think it hurts more when you're being bullied by people of your own community. Do you think so? Yeah. Oh yeah, everyone should check out Dolly's music. He's super talented. Oh, stop. <laughs> you are. We'll post the link below as well so you can find his music. It's really, really good. 
Oh. It ruins my world. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you for watching, and if you want to have these two back in a video, let me know, and I will definitely have them back because they are awesome. So, group hug. Yay.